everyone, my name is Meg. Welcome to the Computex 2023. My, uh, I'm from SRock Red. We are specialized for the um, server related products. What's this guy? This is our, this guy is our um, company, company um, roles. It's your boss. <laughs> is your CEO? No. no. Oh, okay. It's, it's your it's, mascot. Yes. All right. And your mascot has been busy. Yeah, it's quite busy. So what I'm looking at here? Yes. So what is this? This is our first board in Ampere solution and it's in deep micro ethics and support the Ampere Ultra Max. It can support a PCIe Gen 5 uh, by 16 for four slots. Um. Is it uh, ready for mass production? It's still in DVT and we are welcome all the clients who is requiring for the sampling. So, can you say anything el else about what's special about it? So is it for industrial, professional use? Is it for consumers? It's for the data, data center. So the Ampere solution specialized for the lower TDP between uh, compared to Intel solution and, and MD. So they can provide lower cost in the data center. Is it possible I can buy one? Sure. It's for everybody? Yeah, it's everybody. Yeah. And does it fit in a in a box like this? It's gonna fit something something like this? Well we need to we need to fit because uh, this is our first board in uh, in our power line, so all of our team is now designing the related chassis for now. Uh, so there could be server chassis, could be desktop chassis, could, we don't know. We will be the server chassis. Server chassis. Yes. And I see four potential PCIe yeah. slots, right? So yes. it could be GPU? Yes, it can support up to two double width GPUs. And uh, a lot of RAM. Yeah, it can support up to eight RAMs in our MicroEdX uh, motherboard. And it can support the previous and the next Ampere, maybe? Uh, it will be current Ultra Max and Ultra. All right. Uh, can you show a little bit what you show here at the show? So what do you have? You have a lot of servers, yeah. workstations? Yes. So SROC Rack is specialized making server and workstation, motherboard, motherboard and bare bones. So for he, from here, we are starting from the Intel and... So this is Intel? Yeah, we are, have all the Intel solution here, demo here. This is the latest uh, generation in the Intel solution. For the overclocking options, we also have the W790 and Z690 series available in our product line. That's our, the latest. Yeah, this is the latest. So all of our motherboard is covered full range from the mini ITX to the ATX, micro ATX, CB, EB, and the hub width for the, all the server related. And then you have AMD. That's correct. We are having the AMD solution in our product line too. Our AMD also cover from the motherboard to the bare bones, from the mini ATX, deep mini ATX, ATX, micro ATX, everything. We cover everything in the in our product line. Dual we, socket. Dual socket. Yes. We also have our um, hardest model in M5 and M4. This one is our hardest model in our AMD solutions. Nice. And uh, if you look behind here, it looks like nice servers. Yes. This is our 4U NT Notes uh, server. It has the 8 from, 10, uh, 10, 8 from front, 10 from rear. Each slice, each slice, it's a it's a node, and it's suit for the web hosting uh, applications. And there, do you have some for the GPU? The AI? GPU level B there. It's over there. Yeah. 
So these are good for web hosting here? Yes. For the small web hosting, for the media, this one, we have lots of web hosting customers really like this bare bones. And the, no matter the M4 solution, uh, generation or from the M5, we have the hardest, uh, the highest selling in our in our market. Yeah, you just fill it up with hard disks. Yes. Or SSDs. Yes, it can support 3.5, 2.5 SSD in these chassis. All right. We also offer the one U uh, all flash, two U all flash storage server in our product line. This is our 2U, 2U 4G uh, GPU system. Today, all, all you see the bare bones here, we bo offer both Intel and AMD solutions to fit all of our customer needs. What is this? This is NVIDIA H100, and this is a code demo with uh, NVIDIA in our booth. So how many of these you can put in there? So it, for this one, uh, at 100, uh, we will we will we need to still in validation. But for this one, this our 2U4G, it can support up to uh, four GPUs. For this one, this giant here, this called 4U8G, it can support up to eight GPU. But we also have the 10 GPU options called 4U10Gs in our product lines. Is this very popular right now? Yeah, we have some of the customer uh, using on the AI machine learning or the uh, lab researching uh, demands. They are really like this one. Uh, is there a chance that because this is the first one you do with Ampere, yeah. maybe you will do many different options later? Yeah, we are still in designing fast. So maybe you will do some for 10 GPU also, or maybe you will do some for web hosting, and depend, depends. Yeah. All right. And uh, do you want to show a little bit more at your booth? What's happening? Uh, you know everything? <laughs> no. What is this guy doing? This guy is like, he's cooling, cooling some, some yeah, server. Yeah, it's a cooling system uh, in our mother company called Asrock. And this is also a flying yeah. cooler, Superman. Yes. And there. Our gaming board is is available for the for a liquid cool solution. Can I buy this one? Uh, not for sale. I'm not ready. Oh, yeah. Here we have some little desk meat and desk mini. Yes. So this is our uh, mother company called Asrock, who is specialized in gaming and desktop. Uh, motherboard and systems. So here's uh, small boards. Yeah. All boards, uh, systems, monitor, and GPUs. All right. And there's a bunch of displays here, monitors. Yes. And let's go around here. Whoa, what is that? This is our latest mo uh, monitor in our uh, monitor company called SROC. It's available in the uh, market for now. Nice. Actually, GPUs. Yeah, this is our GPUs. It's really fancy. It's including the uh, RG settings for now. So you have a mother company and a divisions <laughs> for the for the company I'm from called Asrock Rack, which are only focusing on the server category. And what is your your category? I'm in the server category. So right here we have the Riptide series. That's some cool setup. Do you have Do you have one of these at home? I hope one day I have. Yeah. yeah. Every employee at Azeroth has one, right? <laughs> we should be. Every time at the office you want to have a break, you just go in this? Um, I, this is only for demo for, for, okay. for, for now. And here? Here 
is our another division called uh, S Rock Industrial, who uh, which is focusing on the uh, IPC category. All right. And they also uh, their main business is also from the motherboard and then and then to the bare bones. Uh, I mean the systems great. It's Intel. suitable, it's yeah. Intel, Intel. IPC is, is still focusing on Intel solution for now. And this is uh, their um, industrial industrial products. So they have all these little industrial. Yeah. What's behind you there? It looks like a charger. Yeah. So maybe it's in a partnership with this company called Ash Jade. SJ actually is one of another uh, latest uh, division from our S Rock. All right. So thank you very much for showing. It's thank great. You. Computex is back. Yes. This is our uh, our first uh, physical Computex comeback in 2023. So welcome to the uh, Computex and hope you see you in next week and next next year. This is the first Computex of this decade. Uh no. Ever to, uh, before uh, after the COVID nineteen. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. Hello, I'm Mr. Beast. No, I'm not Mr. Beast actually. But if I was Mr. Beast and if I was sending you a bunch of money, I would use Wise. Wise is a really smart way to send money around the world. Tiny little fees. Check out my video, a seven minute video where I try to explain some more. It works in hundreds of countries. Every time you go to a different country, use your Wise card or use your Android Pay, your, your uh, Apple Pay to do all your payments with a tiny little conversion pay uh, fee. If you have some customers in different countries, they can send you money to local bank accounts in the US and Europe, all over the world. You can get local bank account details. They transfer tiny little fees. Don't use PayPal anymore. Don't use Western Union. And don't use your bank to send money because it's surprising, but you wouldn't know maybe, but they take fees that are gigantic, that are pretty big. Just use the wise. It's smart.